to my YouTube channel, it's Lucy BJ and I'm back with another video. In today's video I'm going to show you guys how I installed this lovely wig from V Show Hair. It's the Water Wave Lace Front Wig and this hair is so nice. The lace is nice, the thickness of this hair is just amazing and I'm just really impressed, like really impressed and if you just want to see how I installed this wig, keep on watching. So in the box it already comes with a wig cap which I'm using right now. I know the wig cap looks really greenish and yellowish. I could have used the normal one that I use all the time but I thought let me just use what's in the box so you guys can see the whole package and so when you guys order it you guys can you know what to expect. So I applied some foundation just for it to give me a natural colour and so it matches good with the lace. And as you can see, the lace is transparent and look how lovely it looks. I already put some foundation as you can see. I could have used a darker foundation, so it would just, I don't know, I feel like it would have looked a tiny bit better, but it's fine. You can use any foundation. And I'm using the hot comb to just press down the baby hairs and just to press down the hair to make it look flat and to give me that seamless look for when I cut the lace and now I'm just plucking because I saw that it's really easy to pluck so I just just kept plucking and plucking because sometimes plucking can be really tiring but I just thought let me just pluck a bit more to make it look even more natural and look how it looks like in the sun like it's so lovely So now I'm using the Hair by Shopee glue, lace glue, and I'll put everything down in the description box below. Um, this glue is really good. I didn't have to use many layers. I prefer to use two layers because I wasn't going to keep it for that long. But I still wanted to create some cute hairstyles, like half up, half down. So I did want it to stick properly. And I'm also using this Slay by Bailey comb and this comb is really good, it's really strong, it just makes the work 10 times, 100 times easier. And again, I will put everything down in the description box below so it's easier for you guys to see all the products that I'm using. So before I cut the lace around my ears, I'm just pressing down the lace into the glue so it doesn't come off and yeah now i'm just cutting the lace around my ears i've got quite a small head so i never use the whole actual lace i always have to cut it and then i always have to do this as well to add some more lace um i mean some more glue sorry some more glue to make it stick down properly because for some reason that side never sticks down so yeah So now I'm using a scissors, you can use any but I prefer to use a small tiny scissors but I couldn't find it. So yeah I'm just using this scissors and yeah as you can see it just looks so wonderful, it just looks so nice. Like this wig is really nice for when you're going on holiday as well, like oh, someone needs to fly me out, like someone needs to. <laughs> Someone needs to fly me out now, like right now. I can't wait anymore, I'm tired of waiting. <laughs> so it also comes with this headband which you can use when you finish your baby hairs. And I'm using the mousse, the olive oil mousse to do my baby hairs and yes, that's the only thing really that I use. So I'm just pressing it down and letting it dry. So when I take it off, it looks like this, okay? Melt, look at the melt guys. So now I'm doing my baby hairs and because I laid it down with the silk scarf, it's so much easier to do my baby hairs now. So the only thing I'm using is a toothbrush, old toothbrush, but you can use anything. You can get them from the hair shop, the actual, not a toothbrush an actual brush for baby hairs and yeah it's so easy to use so you guys should really go and get some or you can use your old toothbrush <laughs> so 
so now I'm just adding some foundation just so it can match my skin and then I'm using the same uh, scarf again and just to press it down whilst I do my makeup I'm gonna do my makeup off camera and then come back and then show you it's just gonna be a simple glam so yeah so now I'm just adding some setting spray it's not setting spray it's like the dewy spray thing i'll put down in the description box and i do this because i i feel like i've got a structured um cheekbone so that's why i don't like it to be too defined with makeup so i don't like to add like more concealer down there because it's just too much for me and this is how the lace looks like it's so lovely i'm literally in love with this wig imagine this lovely hair on holiday like imagine oh someone's son needs to fly me out like i've had enough but anyways i'm using this revlon setting setting lotion and yeah it's really good it really helps to keep my curls lovely and curly so now I'm using the hot comb to flatten the hair um, because I really love the way it looks like and I just thought if I flatten this wig a bit more it's just going to look amazing. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm just flattening it until it looks gorgeous and oh, I'm just in love with this hair. Right Currently I don't have any wig on my head right now. I just feel like putting it back on and take some pictures. But... I ain't got time for that. <laughs> so yeah. As you can see the hair is really thick as I'm combing it and brushing it through. It's just really lovely. And the lace also is so amazing. As you can see it's dry and it's wet at the same time. So I could have used a bit more setting lotion or mousse to it. But I just feel like I want to put it back on and um like get it dry because apparently water wave is just a really nice texture even if you're going for like a dry look not like the wet look but um yeah i feel like both will just look amazing with this wig literally i really actually really love it i'm really enjoying watching it with you guys because i'm watching it too <laughs> So now I've finished adding some water and some mousse. I'm now trying to figure out if I want to side part in or middle part in. I like, I actually really love the side part. I really love this look. I really love the hair, guys. Look how lovely it looks. It's just really curly and it's just amazing. I just really love it. So the next couple of clips is just going to be me modeling this lovely wig the side part in and then later i will show you guys how the middle part looks like but for now i'm gonna leave you guys and enjoy to see this lovely hair and yeah thank you guys so much for watching make sure you like subscribe and share and i'll see you guys in my next video bye Let's go.